Hey, hi everyone. Um, my name's Anne Wilkins. I'm a senior landscape architect at Novo Group. Um, and what a fantastic opportunity this competition provided for me to collaborate with my sister here, who's an architect at Bosley Architects. So just the two of us. Um, we had a lot of fun doing this. Um, our design was based around um, a study on framing of the landscape. So we started off an idea of um, exploring this function of being kind of separated from the landscape but also in it. And it turned into a progression on social media and how we how we view the landscape and how we feel related to the landscape when we're not in it. And that's of course through social media and through photos. And then we again played on the um, idea of distance and perception and how we play on those elements within the landscape. Uh, so our Nahonga turned into an expression on isolation and versus connection. Uh, so our design ended up being uh, a basic Cortian steel frame with two opposing concrete seats on either side and this basically was a formal expression of that concept where we're framing a landscape but we're there together but we're not quite together so we're on opposite sides of the frame. Um, when we developed this further we, we looked at materiality so we wanted to incorporate Cortian steel and concrete, just some really nice raw materials to express um, the landscape that it was sitting in. We're incorporating uh, LED lights, um, it's a mild steel plate with Cortian on either side structurally and um, then we just, uh, when we were further developing it, we really wanted to look into um, kind of framing that in the sense of basically using COVID almost yeah. in some ways. <laughs> yeah, I think it was, a, it was an interesting process because as we moved through the design, of course everyone was in the same uh, context that we had this weird lockdown experience. So what did it mean to be connected versus isolated was a real um, real time function. Uh, so this expression shows here that we're framing at the top and this is connected and looking through the landscape and then we're offset in reality. So we're actually quite connect disconnected. Uh, so again, we wanted our seat to work in different environments, of course we're landscape architects here. And, um, what did it mean to be in an urban environment? We pictured it here being really collaborative, really fun, lots of, um, lots of interaction. So people can take their photos, take their Instagram shots. Um, we can have um, kids playing in the shadow of the Cortean steel. Of course the Cortean steel, you may have picked up from an earlier slide, is set at a two metre distance. So it's got the scale ruler um, laser cut into the steel frame. So we liked that idea that people can really connect with the element when it's sitting in the landscape. And then of course when we were looking at that wider concept going back to our idea of framing was um, the next shot which was um, in a landscape setting. So if we have it in a, in a brick bay environment, um, hopefully uh, that would be fantastic. <laughs> and it's, a bit, it's a bit more of a place for reflection and quiet um, thought and we really wanted to capture that moment in time that we're walking through. You know, this really crazy environment of being two metres social distance from each other. Um, what does that mean? What does that look like? And so it's a real um, representation of that. And of course, stepping back from the, from the Nahonga, you can frame a view, it can be lined up with a protected tree, it can be lined up with a sculpture in the landscape, it can be lined up with a building. Um, so yeah, that's our seat and we had a lot of fun. Thank you very much. <laughs>